Welcome back to another Real Talk Reaction. This one is for Rick and Morty Season 2, Episode Number 6. Yes, so we got two of our executive producers coming through to comment on Episode 5, starting with Liz Sith, who said, Love this bizarre but hilarious episode. Ice uh, slash water tea was, uh, was the highlight of this episode for me, and hopefully we will see more cameos like this in the future episodes. Yeah, yeah Ice Tea was my favorite part, too. Yeah, the Ice Tea at the end was crazy. That was hilarious. Yeah. Uh, Christina coming through to say, this is one of my favorites, from Ice-T saying, my story begins at the dawn of time, to shit on the floor. I couldn't stop dying. Uh, Keith David voiced Obama. The religious takeover was great. Yeah, it was fantastic. Yeah. That was a really solid episode. Alright, let's jump to episode six right now. Quantum carburetor or something? Quantum carburetor? Jesus, Morty, you can't just add a sci-fi word to a car word and hope it means something. Huh, looks like something's wrong with the microverse battery. We're gonna have to go inside. Microverse battery. Go inside what? The battery, Morty. Be right back, Summer. Stay put, don't touch any buttons, and ignore all random thoughts that feel... Spidery. Wait, you can't leave me here. You'll be fine. Ship, keep Summer safe. Keep Summer safe. Ugh, yeah. oh, wonderful. Hey, excuse me, hello? Uh... Morty, remember eight seconds ago when, <clears throat> when you said go inside what, and I said the battery, and then we showed up here, and I wasn't like, whoa, this is unexpected. This is not what I was expecting. <laughs> Morty, what a perplexing <laughs> mystery right. this is. We're inside the battery. I okay. got it. I got it. Right. I got it. Huh, this isn't right. This pipe's supposed to be sending 20 terawatts of juice up to the engine, Morty. Instead, we've got... Zero? Now what are these people doing? Whoa, whoa, whoa. people? Uh, it's time for some hands-on engine repair. All right, Morty, hold on to something. Whoa. It appears we are being revisited by the alien known as Rick. Who did you say to me? <laughs> you you told me it means much obliged. Much uh, obliged. Right. Uh, <laughs> blow me. No, no, no. Blow me. Oh my god, babe. <laughs> Wait a minute. Taking your power? I mean, that's what I call slavery. No, no, no. They work for each other in exchange Same for exact. money. Same Which they then... Well, that just Same sounds day. like slavery with extra steps. <laughs> Come out of the vehicle with your hands in the air. Scanning a phalanx. Psychological option detected. Gestating. Gestating. Come out with your hands up, or we will be forced to open fire. Incoming. Got a device. Bob, Bob. Daddy. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is fucking horrific. Uh, Daddy. What the hell? Yeah. Whoa. Jesus Christ. Cease fire. Stay back. Cease Christ. Cease fire. Daddy. Oh my god. This is horrible. <laughs> This is slavery. You're talking about creating a planet of slaves. Uh, told you, Zeep. Oh, they won't be slaves. They'll work for each other and <laughs> pay each other money. That just sounds like slavery with extra steps. What? Wait a minute. Did you create my universe? Is my universe a miniverse? Microverse! A uh, teeniverse. Uh, teeniverse. You bastard! Much obliged! <laughs> what the hell is happening? This is healthy, trust me. This You're is healthy. That's all you are! I made you! Your microverse sucks! And your miniverse is the size of a f lobster tank! It's whack! Are they not really aliens? No, they're just a couple of crazy, wacky scientists, you know? So he made a universe, and that guy is from that universe, and that guy made a universe, and that's the universe where I was born? Where my father died. And where I couldn't make time for his funeral because I was working okay, on this my shit is universe. Dark. <laughs> yeah, science, huh? Science, hey, crazy. Thing. You know, one time Rick accidentally shot his laser pistol right through my hand. How you know? I mean, like old lady science. You know, she she's she's a, she's Hello? a real. You gotta hang on tight, you know, because she you she really she gotta hang on tight. Hard. Oh boy, what? Uh, oh, my God, no. oh shit. <laughs> come on, come on, come on. Pterodactyl! 
doing? What's he crafting? I can craft stuff too, pal! Just like I crafted your reality! You crafty son of a... Ow! I crafted the guy that created the planet you're standing on! Oh, I thought we were both here because I created a universe of idiots! Morty. Yeah. Morty, yeah. Holy shit, Morty? I haven't seen you in months. You're leading the tree people? Huh, that's a step up. We have no leaders. We follow only the will of the forest. Ooh, wow. Gay. That is pretty gay. You two that is pretty gay. <laughs> geniuses, but you have spent this time learning nothing. Come with me into the forest. There is something I wish to teach you. Avatar. This is cool, Allah, the spirit tree. For generations, cool, it has guided the. You have to get us the f out of here. These people are backward savages. They eat every third baby because they think it makes fruit grow bigger. Everyone's gross and they all smell like piss all the time. I, I, I miss my family. I miss my laptop. I masturbated to an extra curvy piece of driftwood the other day. Look, I, I don't care what it takes. You two are putting aside your bullshit and you're working together to get us back home. No can't do, Morty. I just can't. I just don't see how I can... Oh, no, 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 no. You're smart. You'll figure it out. Yes! Hey, uh, how about that drink? Sure, I just need to go grab my wallet from inside my ship. Oh, is your wallet in your ship? That's where the transporter is, too, so why don't we come with? It's cool. I'll be... Hi! <laughs> Excuse me? Say that again? Holy oh, hell, sir! Hold your fire! Dismissed. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah. Okay, I get that ice cream. Yeah. You all right? Uh huh. What are you doing, Rick? I'm pretty sure the battery's dead. Well, you think so, huh, Marty? Well, let's see. Hey, wait. Huh? I don't get it. Of course you don't. But Zeke did. He knew that once I got back to my car, one of two things was gonna happen. I was gonna have to toss a broken battery. Or the battery wouldn't be broken. Babe, this is fucking cool. Peace among worlds. Rick. Jesus. Yeah, listen to that baby purr. You do really one, two things, go. episode 26 of Rick and Morty and I don't know where we was going with that whole thing. I mean, it just get got the layers deeper. got deeper and deeper and Literally. weirder and weirder. Yeah, and um but hey, to true to form and on brand that this episode will take it there. They they get a premise and they just like we go just fully commit all the way. All the way down both parts, even with um the sister back at the spaceship and Rick them over there and doing the thing that I mean it was still it was a good time and brilliant. I like the analogies that they used in in the episode and then the uh, the finish off with the post credit scene of the joke that began that I put a car inside you and then he turned into a car. love it all it's a good time, man. this show just gets better and better and smarter and smarter, so I can't wait for the next one. Yeah, this show was brilliant from start to finish. Yeah. I totally agree with you. Both side stories had every element of, oh shit, they're taking it all the way there. Yeah. Like, that shit was cringeworthy. It's almost like, this is really fucking disturbing and dark. And like, I don't know, should we laugh? Because this is so fucked up. Um, but it was hilarious. It was perfectly executed. One of my favorite episodes yeah. um, between both seasons. I really loved it. I thought yeah. it was just really good. And yeah, the post credit scene, already the randomness of like, uh, Rick saying that just in pa passing, which is such a Rick move, like, no explanation, just this, this is something that, yeah, that I did yeah. to you, and then, uh, have that come back in the post credit scene was brilliant. Yeah. Perfectly executed. Loved everything about this episode. Yep. Uh, Fantastic. Okay. Alright, well look, thank you guys again <laughs> for watching another Real Talk Reaction for Rick and Morning Season 2, Episode 6. And until next time, people.
Peace.